Sarah Gomez with Geek Plus. Do you ever stand back, take a look at your traditional warehouse and say, wow, we are wasting so much vertical space. We hear it from potential clients all the time. But don't worry because Geek Plus has a solution for you. Introducing Robo Shuttle System. Wow, look at the use of all of that vertical space. So if you're ready to take a tour of the warehouse, come along with me, let's go. Let me introduce you to the big tall RS and the small P40. Now usually because of safety precautions, we're not allowed to be around robots that are operational, but right now these are not operating, so don't worry. So why the combination of RS plus P40? Well, we need RS to take those totes way up high, but because RS is a bigger bot, it's a little more costly. So it stays in the aisle. Now we take little P40 and these guys are our runners. They're running across the warehouse floor, delivering totes and cartons with speed. We can have many of them running under racks and going to picking stations and put away stations. The put away process starts with P40. So let's take a second to talk about this tiny but very powerful robot. Now P40 can carry up to 35 kilograms in either a tote or a carton. Now here you can see the lifting mechanism is adjustable by 15 inches or 40 centimeters. So in the case of the put away dock, it can adjust lower. But in the case of picking, it can raise nice and high so that it can adjust to the optimal height of the picker for maximum comfort. Now, let's learn more about the put-away process. This is the put-away station. The worker will take the goods in a carton or a tote and place them onto the put-away dock. Then he'll scan the code, the RFID scan code, and our P40 robot will take the goods to the rack to be put up high by Robo Shuttle. Let's talk about how RS and P40 work together for put away. First, P40 will drive over to the rack and it will go under the rack and deposit the item that needs to be stored. Now, P40 and RS work simultaneously, meaning that RS doesn't have to wait for P40. P40 will just put the orders in a queue and RS will do its thing. Now, RS, when it's ready, it will use its extendable forks to match the size of the tote or carton, and then it will take the tote or the carton up and deposit it on the correct shelf. Now that we have put away covered, let's talk about picking. When an item is needed, Robo Shuttle will reach way up high into the racks retrieve the carton or the tote and bring it back down to this lowest rack. Then P40 will take the item and zoom it away to the picking station. Let's talk about some money saving features of Robo Shuttle's system. Not everything has to be stored in this blue tote. In fact, RS and P40 can handle the cartons that the items originally came in through put away, through storage, through picking. During inbounding, the system records the parameters of the carton and how many pieces fit inside that carton. So when it's time for outbounding, the system goes to work. If 
A large carton is ready to go, the system will order a large pick. If a small carton is ready to go, the system will order a small pick. Robo Shuttle system saves time, it saves money, and it eliminates so much waste by using those original cartons. It also saves energy because P40 bots don't need to drive throughout the warehouse and redistribute so many empty blue totes. Here we are at the picking station. Now picking with Robo Shuttle system is fast. Why? Because the picker never has to wait for a tote. See, it all has to do with our little P40 robots. Man, they glide across the floor fast. In fact, they move at about 11 kilometers per hour. Think about a human running at a pretty good clip. So they queue at the side of the picking station. So when the worker is finished picking from a tote or a carton, the next tote or carton is ready to go. Then the worker will place the goods in a tote or a carton here and they are ready to be shipped. Robo Shuttle system has a picking efficiency of 500 cases per hour. RS is fully customizable. So say you have warehouse ceilings that are nine meters high, we can create a RS that will reach up to eight meters high. Or if you have lower ceilings, we can create an RS to fit those needs as well. Now RS is designed using the double gantry lifting system, which is the mechanism that allows RS to move up and down. And that is how Robo Shuttle is able to put totes on racks taller than five meters. This client chooses to use a single deep rack. Now, Robo Shuttle system also supports a double deep rack, which is nice because it eliminates the need for one more aisle. Robo Shuttle system supports a variety of sized cartons. So you can see the different sized cartons here. And in the back, we also have racks. On the screen now, you'll see the dimensions of the cartons and totes Robo Shuttle is able to support. These are the robot charging stations that can charge both RS and P40. They work in 10 minute charging intervals. So say P40 charges for 10 minutes, it can get one and a half hours of work done. Now, if RS is charging for 10 minutes, it can work from two to three hours. Let's talk smart relocation. As with all Geek Plus systems, Robo Shuttle system uses integrated software to ensure that the hottest items are placed on the bottom racks and also closest to the picking station. That way, P40 can come and pick easily based on tomorrow's outbound forecast. Now, this relocation is done at night and also during idle time. Robo Shuttle system is perfect for the apparel industry. Now, we know in the apparel industry that the seasons change very quickly. <laughs> and that allows for a large fluctuation in business volume. So Robo Shuttle system is perfect for the apparel industry because it is able to work with a variety of SKUs and also a large amount of SKUs. Now these SKUs are stored in totes, but they're also stored in cartons. They can be stored in the original cartons that they were shipped in. Robo Shuttle system is also a perfect fit for e-commerce and 3PL clients. E-com because we're making use of all of that vertical space, plus the system can scale up during peak season. And it's a perfect fit for 3PL because the system keeps costs low while being able to handle both B2B and B2C clients, even in complex client scenarios. 
Why is Robo Shuttle system right for your business? Well, let's do the numbers. Picking efficiency is improved by three to four times, while storage density is improved by up to four times with an ROI of only two years. Now, the cool thing about Robo Shuttle system is that it can be deployed in one to three months, depending on the complexity of the project. Wow, that's no time at all. Robo Shuttle system is suitable for B2B or B2C because the system does piece or carton picking. Well, we've come to the end of our tour and we hope you've enjoyed our live tour of Robo Shuttle System. Now, if you have any questions, remember to put them in the comments below. And also, if you wanna see another tour of one of our solutions, just let us know which one in the comments below. Thanks for joining us and have a great day.